Hi guys, few months ago I shared a short video on how to enable Force 5G on any Android device. And I received a lot of requests for a full video tutorial on this. So here we go. First thing first, let me show you the Android device I'm working with. So I got Samsung Galaxy S20 FE, model is G781. And just to give a complete picture, I'm running on One UI 5.1 with Android 13. Now enough for the intro, let's dive right in. So uh, let's see, we have the option for 5G only in our network setting. So uh, let me open the network settings. Here we go. And as you can see, there is no 5G only option. We have got uh, 4G only, but not 5G. Even though I have set it to auto connect with 5G, but it's still not getting that uh, sweet 5G network. Now let's fix that. Don't worry, it's super simple. To get started, we need to download an app. So head over to Play Store. And here, search for the net monitor. And uh, we need to install this uh, first app, net monitor call and Wi-Fi. I already installed it, so let me open it. Once we open the app, we need to complete the onboarding process. It's pretty simple, just follow the prompts. Now we need to give location and phone permission. These permissions are necessary for the app to do its thing. Just go ahead and give the permission. This app is not about forcing 5G. It's a powerful tool that provides detailed network information. You will find features like network stand detail, nearby uh, network information, and even Wi-Fi letter inside. One particularly useful feature is the tower list, which shows you the strength of each tower nearby. But let's back to our mission, enabling 5G. Head over to home screen of the app and look for the service menu. Once you are there, click on phone info. Here we need to select your SIM card from the phone index. If your 5G SIM is in slot 1, then uh, select phone 0, otherwise choose uh, phone 1. Now scroll down uh, until you find preferred network type. Here we go and here search for NR only. NR stands for uh, network radio. Remember, after selecting it, your network might uh, sometime act up, especially if your 5G network is not strong in your area. Voila! As you can see, after 10 to 15 seconds, our network has switched to 5G. Check out that 5G icon right there. Since the 5G network isn't great uh, in my area where I am recording this video, uh, that's why I'm getting only one network. Now uh, let's double check 5G in the uh, settings. So uh, let's close all the app and head over to settings. And go to connections, then mobile network. And there you have it. As you can see under SIM1 we have got option for 5G only. As this is temporary you will not see 5G in uh, options with uh, LTE or auto connects. Now if you prefer to let your phone automatically switch to 4G and 5G, just click on network mode and select auto connect. This way, if your 5G network isn't strong, your device will seamlessly switch to 4G. As 5G network is not strong here, after a few seconds, uh, my device will automatically switch to 4G. So as you can see, uh, my device is automatically switched to 4G+. Guys, if 5G network is good in your area, then use this option, force 5G, otherwise don't use it. Guys, one more uh, thing to keep in mind. If 5G network in your area is weak and you are forced your phone to use 5G, then there is a chance you might have trouble receiving phone calls. So it's essential not to use 5G only option if the network isn't good in your area. So guys, that's a wrap up on tutorial how to force uh, 5G on any Android device. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. Remember why 5G can offer blazing fast speed, it's essential to consider your network strength in your area before making any changes to your device. Hope you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give a big thumbs up and subscribe our channel for more tech tips. This is Jarvis signing off.